All right, this is Eddie Cruz for Trucking Master CDL Training. Now, I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna explain upshifting and downshift. This is a 10 speed, take a look at it, 10 speed. All right, it's a 10 speed. So I'm gonna explain double clutching, upshifting and downshifting, because what most people do, they try to program themselves how to do this. I'm gonna help you understand this, okay? So I'm, you're gonna see me shift up and down. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start in first gear. I'm gonna raise my RPMs to about 1,000 RPMs. Second gear. Third gear, fourth gear, fifth gear. Now, I'm gonna let go of the vehicle, let it slow down before I go to a lower gear. I'm gonna go third gear. That's third gear. Slow it down. And first gear. Now I'm gonna go back up. Now I'm gonna explain this. Now, when I, when I went to first gear, I increased the speed of the vehicle before I gave it to second gear. In second gear, I increase this vehicle to give it the third gear and so on and so on. Now, I'm going to go back to the first. I'm going to show you the concept. Okay, first gear, I went faster, second gear. I'm going to go faster, third gear. I'm going to go faster, fourth gear. I'm going to go faster, fifth gear. Now, I'm going to let the vehicle slow down. And then now, as the vehicle slows down, I can actually put it... I can actually put it in a second gear because now that matches the gear. Now if it grinds a little bit, that means the speed is too low for that gear. Go to a lower gear and it falls right into place. All right, see, and it went to first gear because I can feel the vehicle slow down. So as I'm slowing down, but think about it, I'm reversing the process. So first gear, I go faster, second gear, I go faster, third, and so on and so on. If you're in fifth gear or any higher gear, before you're downshifting, the vehicle has to slow down first before you give it to the lower gear so the gear and the speed matches. If you're slowing down and it grinds a little bit, go to a lower gear because the vehicle's too fast for that low gear. If you go to lower gear, then the, then the vehicle grabs onto that gear and slows the vehicle down. But understand the concept. Upshifting, you go faster. Downshifting, you have to slow the vehicle down whether you use the brake or, or let go of the fuel. The vehicle has to slow down and then matches that low gear. That's the understanding of upshifting and downshifting. All right, so I hope this helps you out. All right, this is Eddie Cruz for Chuck and Masters. I'll see you guys around. Comment below. Let me know if you want a video. But this is the concept of double clutching. Upshifting go faster. Downshifting, slow the vehicle down and it'll grab it from your hand. All right, I'll see you guys around.